Hi, Super Zeus here of Bethlehem and Terra Dimensions doing a minus minus video, episode 28. And we are actually in another slow spot because we can't get the new infinity dimension. We can get E3 335 infinity points. That's about it. I can get one more replicated galaxy. And there's nothing I can really do. I'm hitting another wall. There are so many walls in this game. It's pretty ridiculous. I yeah, it's it's ridiculous. So I I'm going to do this, and I'm I'm actually gonna keep the zero replicated galaxies for now. And I also I'm just short on the sick on the seventh replicated galaxy, but maybe I can just wait for it. But what I'm actually gonna do I'm, I'm gonna go for achievements, specifically this one and that one. So while keeping our infinite replicanti, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do one e two fifty, try to get the Try to get the one, um, this this one. It doesn't look like I can get this one, considering how it's been, like, yeah, it, it's, I don't think I'm going to be able to get this one. I may be able to, here we go, we got this one. So, this actually does give a reward. Maybe we can try the 1E200, and if I hold M down, no, it, it is, this is, it's, it's just not going to do it. I mean, even if I, this is the other thing, I actually want to get some infinities happening here, and maybe, what if I don't get any galaxies? I'm actually thinking, if I infinity, how many dimension boosts can I get? That's about, I'll do 735, that, I feel like that's a good strategy to get quick infinities. Now, it's not going to get me the E200 infinity points, however, it's going to help me grind infinity stat, I think. Okay, no, not one. I need to do like one E150. So this will actually, because I have time study number 32, or um, this one, I'm going to be getting 739 more infinity stat every infinity. This allows me, if I hold the M key down, to get about 2,000 infinities every second. Hopefully... All these infinities, like you can see, they're buffing this. It's making them cheaper. This will allow me to get more antimatter galaxies, which means that I will be able to act to get more antimatter. And then hopefully that will allow me to get to E60,000 antimatter. I know this is grindy and slow. It's really, and it's tough considering I cannot get this achievement. I mean, maybe I can try for it again, but I don't think I can get it. And then this one is also impossible. This one's even harder than that one. It's just, um, yeah, there's nothing much I can do. I mean, maybe I could try to get some of these. And I don't think I can really get any of these at this point. So I'm just going to be grinding infinities for a long time. I, I think last eternity I had like 120 million infinities. So, if I can get that many infinities, that would be extremely useful. So, that's what I'm going to do. So, see you in a long while. Okay, I am back after, like, a day. And when I've, I've actually used the console to give myself infinities, because this is about the rate that I'm getting them. So, yeah, 300 million infinities. This makes this E3200. Um... Yeah, the normal dimensions are that much cheaper. Hopefully, that's going to allow me to get a record amount of antimatter. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, or yeah, re record amount of antimatter, which means more infinity points and all that. Oh yeah, it's crunching. I probably have to stop doing that. And you can just see how quick it is. I'm not sure if I use the performance ticks to. No, it's still 33 milliseconds. But you can see we can get. We can get a lot more antimatter galaxies than before. This is huge. Like, really, this is... I don't think I got anywhere near this amount of antimatter galaxies. This is 240. Maybe I can even reach 250. I think I was, like, 180 or 190. And all of a sudden, we can actually unlock both infinity dimensions. Both new infinity dimensions. Not just, not just the first one. Also, I forgot to buy these last infinity so, I'll get that, and you can see, with all these infinity dimensions, um, y you're gonna be able to see, I have, how many galaxies do I have? 254 galaxies. 
This allows me to get E418 infinity points. And since I did grind this much infinities, I'm, I'm actually going to try to push a little bit farther so I don't need to encounter any more of these walls because seriously, these walls are brutal. And, and maybe we can get some more achievements from like the infinity point multipliers and these infinity dimensions. So while we're getting our galaxies, I can just get all of these. And then of course the replicanti upgrades. I'm not gonna get any replicated galaxies at this point. Also, we can get more time theorems which is going to help us a lot. So you can just see how how much I'm getting here. I can get a ton of these as well. I don't know why the printer's going off, but uh, yeah. Let's see how many galaxies we're going to get this run. 256 galaxies. This is going to allow us to reach E455 infinity points, which now we can get three eternity points from eternity. We're also going to, this time we're going to check the time, and we're gonna check like the time studies, time theorems, because seriously, this, this is this is actually really useful. And actually, e four hundred fifty infinity points. That's that's a big deal because that means we can actually get a new upgrade. So I'm first is gonna go here, get this, grab that. I can get this, but I can't really. I don't. I could get it. I think I want. I may want to go for which which one? This one. Yeah, the new upgrade, which is under Break Infinity, it's this galaxy upgrade. The formula is going to be better. This is going to allow me to. It's now actually it's not that powerful at this point. Like it went from like E3200 to 3300. I mean that that that's pretty that's decent, but it's not it's not going to be not as powerful as I thought. Well, it did allow me to get two extra galaxies, allowing us to reach E476 infinity points. I think we're going to max out at about E500, considering where we are. And the replicating galaxies can actually be pretty quick here. So if I just get this, I'm not sure how quick that really is. Like, I could try. It's 43 seconds. That's that's how how easy it is to re get a replicated galaxy now. It's pretty ridiculous. But the next break infinity upgrade, it's E700 infinity points. Dimension boosts make... Galaxy upgrade 13. I'm not sure if it's this one or that one. Um, but, dim but dimension boosts are going to make that stronger. So now this is E489 infinity points. And I can get four eternity points from eternity. I don't think I'm really going to be able to to reach more. I, I don't think I'm going to be able to reach the, this this time study. Like you can see I have three. And I just... I just I'm not quite there yet. This is, this is still really, really good. Like you can see, it's now only 38 seconds to get infinite replicanti, which of course that's going to make everything even faster. And now I have 261 galaxies. I could push for E500 infinity points. I'm not sure if I actually want to do that. I mean, I, I think I'll do it because it's, it's cheap to get, to get it. Like really, it, it's just the replicated galaxies they're now like 35 seconds so i'm just gonna go for the e500 500 infinity points so i can get some more time theorems and yeah see in a bit okay so now we have three replicated galaxies and we can get e500 infinity points and we have e80,000 antimatter so that's going to allow us to go for some more achievements because there, there's definitely some achievements i want to get there's this one big crunch for e200 infinity points in just two seconds i feel like with this amount of infinity points it's possible to actually do that so if i just unfortunately i have to spam these one by one that's really annoying but you can see you just eat 200 and that should yeah there we go there is that achievement and then there's the the beat in the infinity challenges really very quickly because there's this one and this one they're essentially the same thing and that'll give me more achievement rows and you know i i want to get these achievement rows so what i'm going to do i'm just gonna have this set to crunch at one infinity point infinity point so i can just get the challenges completed really quickly super quick infinity challenge one infinity challenge two is of course like of course the, these infinity challenges the early ones are going to be super easy this one hmm this one is okay i, I just i just need i just need to click d to dimension boost and then this one is 
Vanilla Infinity Challenge 4. This one's actually taking a while, so unfortunately I don't think I'm going to be able to get these achievements. I think there we, we go. We got it in uh, 8 seconds. So yeah, it's not the quickest thing ever, but it's whatever. I, it, it'll, it'll do. I mean, I'm not going to get the achievement, but at least we're going to lower the times down. So there's that. it's now a little under 8 seconds. This makes me... I don't think I'm even going to get this challenge. This challenge is just ridiculous. Seriously, like, there's nothing you can do. Like, I'm at E500 infinity points, and it's still a hard challenge. Like, I'm just I'm doing it as quick as possible, and, and I can't even beat the challenge in a quick time. So, yeah, that, that's, that's unfortunate. Like, even at this amount of infinity points, but whatever. I think it is time to eternity for the second time. And I could try to go for this. Eventually, I will need to get that. It's eternity with exactly nine replicanti, but I think the replicate chance in the interval is just too high to try to get that. So, yeah. Since we have the new get, the new infinity break infinity upgrade... Actually, no, it's only... You, you lose them. Until you get the, I think, the fourth eternity milestone. No, it's not the fourth. That's like the 20th eternity milestone. So that's a little bit unfortunate, but whatever. I have to deal with that. Hopefully, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be getting four eternity points. This is going to allow me to get the this time study, which I think is going to be huge. Like I, I, I really believe that. And also, this will allow me to get the second, no, not the second time dimension, but this. At least it'll buff this. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out.